What's up everybody, this is Investing Sensei here to bring you another episode in the series of how many shares of a certain company do you need to have to make $1,000 every single month. Uh, then we also calculate how much do you need to have invested or how many shares do you need to have invested to make $100 every single month. And then as well, how many or how many shares or how much do you have to be invested to make $100 every single week. So this is a super fun uh, series to make. Definitely enjoy making the videos. Uh, but on the list today, guys, we are gonna be going uh, over ABR, uh, Arbor Reality Trust. Uh, so this is the one on the list. Uh, these are the ones that we will be going over uh, in the following videos. Let me know in the comment section if you want me to do a specific one that you don't see on the list. Uh, hopefully I have not done that in the past. Uh, so. Uh, drop your uh, you know companies you want me to go over and then I'll be sure to add them on here uh, So let's go ahead and get started guys. So I do have seeking alpha. You'll see that it's ABR Arbor Reality Trust uh, currently trading about $13.96 uh, let's go ahead and uh, go over here a little bit to the company profile. So Arbor Reality Trust invests in uh, a diversified portfolio of structured finance assets in the multifamily, single family rental and uh, commercial real estate markets in the United States. The company operates in two segments, structured business and agency business. It primarily invests in bridge and uh, Minsense loans, including junior participating interest in first mortgages and preferred and uh, direct equities, as well as real estate related joint ventures, uh, real estate uh, related notes and various mortgage related securities. Uh, so a lot of in the single family, uh, multifamily rental uh, business portions of uh, this company i'm definitely not invested in this company but they are in the sector of financial uh, industry mortgage reits uh, current employees is about 579 uh, they were founded in 2003 and then uh, here's the website if you wanted to check them out a little bit more about them uh, you'll see here's the revenue uh, but we're not going to dive into in this uh, we're we're just briefly going over this company if uh, obviously if you guys want me to dive into a specific company more let me know in the comment section but uh, let's go ahead and look a little bit about it so if we look at the uh, year to date right now it's actually down 24.91% uh, uh, from a high of about $18 uh, if we look at the one year 22.40% uh, that it's down and then if we look at the five years, it's actually still up 72.13%. Let's look at the 10 year, it's up 166.92%. And then if we look at the max year from, I guess, 2003 when it first uh, started, uh, we're still down 27.37%. Uh, if we look over here, 52 week range, uh, and I guess maybe I should probably do the year to date, uh, but 52 week range is uh, lowest if they've gone is about $12.18. Uh, highest is uh, $20.74. If we look at the EPS is 1.61, uh, PE 8.68, uh, dividend rates $1.52. Yield is 10.46%, and then uh, market cap is $2.46 billion in market cap for Arbor Reality Trust. Uh, let's go over here to the dividend uh, scorecard. I uh, remember they are in the financial sector. Uh, so if we look at the dividend summary, uh, you'll see that uh, dividend yield is a, a very, very large one, which is 10.89%. You definitely want to do a little bit more research into this company before you are invested or i guess before you actually start a position uh, because that's a very high uh, dividend yield typically a very safe and uh, consistent uh, and you know a dividend that won't be cut majority of the time is a dividend between anything actually less than three percent to four percent at the most uh, that's a very healthy one uh, if we look at the annual payout is a dollar 52 cents so every share you own you'd get a total of a dollar 52 cents uh, the overall year 
uh, payout ratio is 68.54% on the higher end for the payout ratio. Five-year Kager is pretty amazing, 16.86%. Uh, there's actually no dividend growth, but uh, again, Seeking Alpha has been known to actually have this area of the information incorrect sometimes. But uh, you'll see they do pay out quarterly. They pay out about 38 cents every single quarter. But uh, yeah, it's a pretty, you know, amazing dividend yield. It's kind of like a risky one for me personally. So definitely would require some more research. Let me know in the comment section if you're invested in ABR and why you are if you're a long term investor on this one. Uh, but it'll be interesting to see actually how high did this dividend yield uh, get, uh, especially in the 2020 market crash, uh, which we will go over after we do the calculations. We'll look at a chart that shows you when the best opportunity was to enter this uh, company, uh, you know, when we refer to as dividend yield. But uh, let me go ahead and pull up the calculator. Uh, and then that way we can uh, actually start doing some calculations, guys. So uh, first thing we want to do, guys, here. Uh, you'll see that uh, we're going to actually want to make uh, $12,000, well I guess $1,000 every single month. That means we need to find how much we need to make the total year. So this is going to be $1,000 times 12 because there's 12 months in a year. So total for the year we need to make $12,000. For us to find out the number of shares we need for that is you'll divide the annual payout which is $1.52 by that $12,000. And that should give you the total number of shares you need. So we roughly need about 7,894 shares uh, in order to make $12,000 a year. And then to know how much you actually need to own invested uh, total amount right now if you were to purchase it, uh, you would multiply these shares times the sh current share price of $13.96. Uh, so times $13.96. That would give you roughly about $110,210, which you'd have to be invested in uh, Arbor Realty Trust. Uh, and then you would be making about uh, $12,000 a year, which is roughly about $1,000 every single month. So that would be pretty amazing. But again, that dividend yield doesn't look very safe. You know, obviously would need more research. But a quick way for you to do this math really quick would be uh, you could actually do the 12,000 that you want to make a year and then you divide it by the dividend yield so 10.89 percent so 0.1089 and uh, you'll see that it'll roughly give you about hundred and ten thousand dollars as well so that's a quick way to uh, calculate that let's go ahead and find out how much would you need to own of this company to make $100 every single month I feel like that one's a little bit more achievable you could actually divide the last previous result by 10 and that should give you the total result but just because it's fun to uh, crunch numbers into the calculator uh, we'll go ahead and do it so we want to make $100 every single month and remember there's 12 months in a year so we need to roughly make about $1,200 uh, for the year then you divide it by the annual payout so $1.52, that'll give us about 789 shares we need to own. And then you multiply it times the share price of $13.96. So we need to roughly own about uh, 11,000 or we need to invest about $11,000. And we would be roughly making about $100 every single month uh, from Arbor Reality Trust. A quick way to do this math would be divide the 1,200 that we want to make a year divided by the uh, dividend yield 1089. So you'll see we'll definitely get about 11,000. So quick rough estimate there. And let's go ahead and do the last one, guys. But before we do that, again, if you have not subscribed to the channel, be sure to use subscribe, put that bell notification and drop a big thumbs up on the video to help out the channel. Definitely helps out and uh, definitely appreciate it. Uh, we have hit over 7,000 subscribers. So that is all thanks to all of you guys. Uh, but let's go ahead and uh, do uh, $100 every single week. So that's how much we want to make. Uh, there's actually 52 weeks in a year. So we're going to multiply that times 52. Uh, there's actually, so we need to make roughly about $5,200. Uh, to make uh, $100 every single week and then uh, from there we're going to divide it by the annual payout again 
to find out the total number of shares we need to own. So we need about 3,421 shares and uh, our Reality Trust. You can multiply this times the share price, which is $13.96. And that would give you roughly how much you need to have invested in this company, about $47,757.89, about uh, in Reality, in, uh, Reality, Arbor Reality, uh, trust. I don't know why I was wanted to say Reality Income, but uh, Arbor Reality uh, Trust. Uh, so quite a bit of a, amount of money, but a lot less compared to a lot of other companies we've done in the past. But again, this dividend uh, rate, I'm not sure if it's very maintainable in the long term, especially if we hit a recession. I'm not sure guys, Not definitely not uh, having dived into all the financials of this company. But uh, yeah, let me know in the comments if you are invested in this company. Very, very juicy dividend yield, but uh, something that is very uh, cautious that I would be going towards with that shiny dividend yield. But uh, let's do real quick, just to summarize this, 5,200, quick way to calculate this is uh, divide this by the dividend yield. Uh, and that would give you roughly about $47,000 is what you'd have to be invested to make $100 every single week. So pretty, pretty sweet, guys. Let's go ahead and wrap up this video by going over the dividend yield. So you'll see this is the dividend yield. Uh, you'll see Arbor Reality Trust. This value right here is the dividend yield. So obviously, if the price of the stock uh, went down, the uh, yield would have been actually going higher. Uh, so you'll see that this fluctuates. It's always stayed around 8 to 10% dividend yield. But you'll see that in the March 2020. Uh, so March 2020, it spiked all the way up to about 20, uh, probably higher. I just can't seem to get it. About 27% dividend yield. Uh, that was pretty amazing, guys. That was around April 2020. And then it crashed down. And that is probably because the price of the stock actually went up words unless they had a dividend cut there but you'll see it's been fluctuating around seven percent eight percent and finally it's going around ten percent probably because the stock of the price the price of the stock has gone down uh, but uh, yeah let me know if you guys are invested in uh, Arbor Reality Trust in the comment section this is actually all I have for you guys again if you have not subscribed to the channel be sure that you're subscribed with that bell notification Help us reach 8,000 subscribers. We finally hit 7,000, so it's pretty amazing. And uh, don't forget to drop a big thumbs up on the video to help out the channel. And uh, I will catch you in the next video. Take care, stay safe out there. Bye, guys.